All right, so today we are gonna talk about this guy right here. This is the TalkPod A36 Plus. Just kidding. This is not an A36 Plus. Yes, it is, Matt. You can't fool me. I know, I know. This is an A36, but it's not a Plus. It's an A36 SE. SE standing for spurious emissions. Just kidding. Maybe. This thing was a bit of an enigma to me. I saw it pop up on Amazon and I thought, hmm, it's not an A36 Plus. What's the difference? Well, as I researched it, I couldn't find out. So I decided to order one. Finally arrived today and I'm looking at it and I'm going through it and it arrived as a GMRS radio, just like the A36 Plus does. And uh, it was programmed improperly, just like not a Rubicon found with the A36 Plus. So I had to go in and fix that using Chirp. Once I did, it operated fine on the GMRS bands, no issue. I am licensed as a GMRS operator. I am also a licensed ham operator, so please don't come at me in the comments. So what was the difference? Um, it unlocked just like an A36 Plus by doing the push to talk and you hold down eight and power it on at the same time. That worked, so that wasn't different. I was pretty well convinced that the guts were the same as the A36 Plus. Well, let's make a long story short. The difference between this and an A36 Plus, and man, I'm making the screen a mess. I bet this is driving some of you crazy. Uh, the difference is this doesn't come with a programming cable. That's it. The battery is USB-C rechargeable. It comes with the charging cradle. It comes with obviously the belt clip and the wrist strap. It comes with the antenna. Uh, it can access the air bands. Like I said, it can be opened up to other frequencies. Don't transmit on frequencies you're not licensed for, but you do you. Um, yeah, the only difference is no programming cable. So this is $28.99 with a 15% coupon right now on Amazon. I do not have an affiliate link because I'm not an affiliate. You can just go find this yourself and purchase it if you want it. Now that being said, spurious emissions. I do have a tiny SA, but I do not have an attenuator yet. When I get an attenuator, I'm gonna be hooking this up and seeing what kind of performance I get out of it, specifically spurious emissions. These things, from what I can tell, have been all over the board. Some of them are clean, some of them are a mess. I don't know what to expect with this thing, but when I do run those tests, I'm gonna to try to make a video of that so that you can see what happens. Hopefully it's clean, but you never know. All right, so that is the story on the TalkPod A36 SE. Again, you can find it on Amazon if you're interested in one. If not, you know, let it pass on by. I'm sure there'll be something else that will tickle your fancy. All right, that's it. Talk to you later. Oh yeah, and then uh, 7-3.